The Division 7A rules are triggered when a company lends money or transfers property for less than its market value to the shareholder or the shareholder's associate, loans money to a shareholder or shareholder's associate without a formal credit agreement, and the loan is not fully repaid by the financial year's tax return lodgement date, or relieves the shareholder or the associate of debt owed. Unless a Division 7A loan agreement exists, these transactions will form part of the shareholder's assessable income and be subject to income tax at their marginal tax rate. It'll be treated as an unfranked dividend to the shareholder, which basically means that you'll be paying an excessive amount of tax on this money. So a Division 7A loan is essentially a way that companies can financially accommodate their shareholders and have it treated as a loan rather than an income distribution. 